Oftentimes, art imitates life, and for a couple of artists here in Milwaukee, they've really been inspired by the box. This is very cool. We want to go live right now to our Gabrielle Mays, who is just about 100 yards to my 7 o'clock right here. She's joining us live <laughs> at Gather. And Gabby, this art really does speak for itself. No, it really does. And have you ever had that moment where you're looking at something and you go, how did you do that? That's exactly how I felt today. I was just absolutely surprised at some of the things that these two artists have to offer. 50 hours of painting crammed into this one minute video. People love seeing the progress of the work and seeing it go from a blank canvas to a finished product. Milwaukee artist Brad Gears shares his love of the bucks through paint. The movement and the, the excitement of the bucks like in the playoffs and painting that is is just really exciting. His work highlights memorable moments of the game. This was just March 31st when he became the all-time leading scorer and it was such an amazing game because they went to overtime. Gears shares his painting process. I use a lot of marker to outline things as well and it's all acrylic paint so it, it dries fast. I can kind of keep building layers on. From starting out with sunflowers to Giannis portraits. The like actual insides for this pair. I just put the Bucks logo with like Milwaukee skyline. Bucks fan and artist Mitchell K. Well uses shoes as his canvas. So I try to start with what I think is going to be the hardest. So I have like the most energy for that one. If I mess it up, I could like start over on that. K. Well says this design takes up to 20 hours to finish. So I get to just zone out be in my own like I go at my own pace too, um, so I don't know. It's kind of like a nice little release from the world. While these two artists' styles are different, their love for their favorite team paints the perfect picture. I'm battling the wind out here, so I had to throw my umbrella because it just broke. Anyway, let me tell you this stuff. Gears says that he just finished that Bobby Portis painting yesterday because I said, do you have, I, I messaged him, I said, do you have any other paintings? And he said, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll get you one. And so that Bobby Portis painting was finished yesterday just because I asked him if he had another one. And then when it comes to k -Well, he says those shoes, he says he wears those shoes to every home Bucks game. And I said, come on, do people say like, look, look at those shoes, who made those shoes? He goes, yeah, people look at him and go, hey, I like your shoes. And he goes, I painted them. It's actually really cool. They're super talented <laughs> and I wish I was as talented as them. Reporting live outside the Deer District at Gather <laughs> overlooking the Deer District. Gabrielle Mays, Fox 6 News.